so starting over trigonometric sine rule and cosine rule before that let me just revise trigonometric ratio so patoa is only applicable when there's a right angle triangle okay yes sir so first of all so there should be a right angle and there should be one angle given theta either this way or if i take the same triangle let's say this one and angle is given over here so it makes the difference now over here can you tell me what is opposite in the first figure and what is opposite in the second figure okay uh, so opposite will be the, the tell me the name abc ab yeah ab will be opposite so this will be opposite okay opposite means opposite to theta yeah. yes or no yes and uh, what is the hypotenuse uh, it will be ac ac so this is the hypotenuse and the remaining side is adjacent okay yeah what about this in the second figure xyz what is opposite opposite will be zy zy very good and what is hypotenuse x x and this will become adjacent is this thing clear yeah so quickly copy this thing and based on this thing uh, we can do the formula so sin this is what sin sin means opposite upon opposite upon hypotenuse opposite upon hypotenuse Cos, cos theta means uh, adjacent by hypotenuse. Adjacent upon hypotenuse and tan is uh, opposite tan theta adjacent. opposite by adjacent. So that's how Sokka to a formula uh, yeah. comes, and that will be helpful in arriving at the remembering the formulas. Okay, quickly yes. copy this thing, and I will give two three question based on this thing. Okay. So try to do these questions, okay. So step number one is to first of all identify what is opposite, what is hypotenuse and all that. For that, for your reference, can you tell me what is opposite over here in the first question? Opposite will be X. So this is opposite. So write down opposite with a different color pen for yourself in the paper also. And what is hypotenuse? Uh, eight. eight. Hypotenuse is always opposite to 90 degree. Yeah. And the remaining becomes adjacent. Now, we want to find out the relationship between o, o and H. If we go back, O and H. O and H is over here. Sine theta. Is it making sense? Yeah. So, sine 61 degree equals to opposite is x upon 8. Okay. Okay. Now, use n sol. Okay. After this, quickly tell me the answer. Use n sol. Over here, uh, answer was coming. What was the original answer? Uh, 6.996. 996. The three significant figures would be 1, 2, 3. Seven, seven point so, answer would be zero, x zero. 0, 0. Don't forget to put centimeter. Okay. Centimeter is important. Okay. So, okay. question number 2, 3, and 4. Do it and send me as homework, okay? Okay.